Now let's take you to China, where the authorities have ordered a coronavirus lockdown in the area around the world's biggest iPhone plant. This is days after workers there were seen fleeing because of strict COVID rules on site. Let's go straight to our Asia Business Hub. Our correspondent Katie Silver is there. Katie, what's the latest? Yes, Sally. So this has all emerged within about the last hour. And what we're hearing really is that this region in Zhengzhou is going into lockdown for at least a week. What that means is people can't leave their homes. They're being encouraged to work from home. No cars on the street. And for workers there, it does potentially mean more confinement. Now, we all remember these scenes that we saw earlier this week. Workers, scores of workers fleeing uh, the factory. It employs around 200,000 people. That makes about 70% of the world's iPhones. And what we've heard, for example, is that the scenes there are quite miserable. Low no amounts of food, not enough water, people being confined to their rooms in order to eat. Now, we've heard from the company also in the last 24 hours saying that they're going to increase bonuses to workers who continue to work. Really a sign of trying to ease some of this discomfort and retain the workers to, in the order of about four times or 55 US dollars a day in bonuses. So that's one uh, activity that they're doing to try and encourage workers to remain. And this is really going to be very important for Apple, as I say, a great number of iPhones come from there. Companies so far saying that it's not going to impact production in November, although some sources have said production could dip from this plant by as low as 30%. So it's a watch and see, Sally. Okay, we shall certainly do that. Katie, thank you very much.